Okay, so those three stones, guys, are the three sisters, so each hump represents a sister. So one, two, three. It's pretty cool. It's called Blue Mountain because it's self-explanatory. Other than that, I best be going. So in front of me was Echo Point, or is Echo Point, sorry. Yeah, grammar, still tired. Uh, anyways, what you do in there is cafe, if you want to chill, have some tea, coffee, whatever, and a gift shop to represent that monument over there. Or not monuments. Why am I messing up my English? The Blue Mountain, along with the three sisters. So I'm on the tram, waiting to get to the other side right here. Hopefully we don't die. No one cuts this line off and fall down. But in the meantime, I highly doubt that. And he is preparing us for takeoff. Uh, it doesn't. We've got a couple of ladders. Useless for the day. <laughs> uh, for those on the glass wall, keep looking down. You guys are about to get a pretty cool view, I reckon. Can you see it yet? Huh? How about now? Huh? Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, so for those you Backfired on the people. <laughs> You may have been told in the past that the word Katoomba comes from a Gundagara word. So he made up a fraudulent story that was going to help him in his business venture. So you can go down the train and come back up the train. Six hours later, maybe you should do it. Go down and you'll have to go. You'll have to walk back up. And then you could maybe go back down the train again and then walk to the blue and come up the blue. You'll have time to do that. Maybe follow these guys. Yeah. Just follow this. We'll guys. stick together. Stick right? together. Let's yeah. go. Alright, thank you, sir. Okay, go on. I swear, I think my parents are just taking this too far. Red. I think it'll be more fun to go wet down. Yeah. 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 My mom's pretty smart, so we'll follow her. Blue up. Okay. Let's show you some Yeah. And then we can take a walk from here to here and come back up. So we're taking the red train down the hill. You can I either pick any of those three angles? We're gonna do the cliffhanger, so therefore I don't want to risk my phone getting lost. So therefore I'm gonna use my small camera, which won't be that bad if I lose it. So see you in a bit, guys. And that is what we just went through. The steepest train in the world. The world's steepest train. I wonder what's in there, but if you can look in. But right now, guys, this is just our trail. And then in a bit, it's a 15 minute walk to the blue train that will head in a bit. There's a lot of coals around here. It's pretty historical. Every national park has its history, so therefore it has its historical landmark. <laughs> And it's not surprising because Australia has interesting animals. When I came there, like, uh -huh. like my first time. Oh wow, nice. Yeah, 2008 was nice, but when I came back like two years ago, second uh -huh. time, 
Jesus, it's so, it's so changed. I mean, price wise, uh huh. It's the price Only in Australia. And in here, if you look, you see the back? Yeah. So they are the seed pods. That's the seed. That's the seed. So huh. they only open after a fire. Smoke through the fire. You can see some of these yellowy ones that were from just, uh -huh. they're from about a month ago. Yeah, so if you're so not, the giant stairway. If you're not, if you're not fit, don't do it because you're going to have to come back and go straight to the bus. So let's do it if you want to. If you want to, let's do it. Okay. The giant stairway. Here we go, people. We're walking. Oh gosh, that was pretty steep. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. We just go down to the bridge, no further. Under the bridge. No, just to the bridge and then take I feel like I'm doing something up. illegal, but the tour guy said we it's need okay. It the white building. I'll yes, bring sir. The bus down to the white building. Yes, where sir. We, where we got off this morning, okay? All right, yes, sir. So 20 minutes. Oh, next to the coffee yeah. shop. It's pretty steep, if you, as, as you just saw. And then the bridge. Um, here, I'll, I'll walk through the bridge one more time for you guys. Especially when it's windy, it's even scarier when it's windy. So, going back up. So now, you uh, can see other people on the other side smiling. To take pictures, you can go further down, but our two guy told us not to go down. So, inside of the bridge, we go back up here. And, yeah, I think it's amazing. So I just came back from this. It's really steep. I lost my tour guide, but that's alright. That's a hell of an exercise. And then this beautiful brick here. It's really unique. It's really unique breaking here. I love it. But now I think it's time for us to go. I made a new friend in Australia, and now he's wearing my merch. Cantrenier. It's looking awesome. Ice. Kangaroo burger. Seems pretty chill. <laughs> literally how close you could be to them and of course everybody comes to see the koalas right here there we go i'm like right near the koala like right now like can i put them one more time oh, I, you can. all right cool and just one touch of it to prove that i actually touched the koala here and the nails are really sharp, so I would not mess with them. Okay, guys, so we'll just stop people petting them earlier. <laughs> See, around the sanctuary, you can actually pet the animals. Some of them you can. If there's no sign, it means you can pet them. They're pretty open. I can pet this one without it biting me. <laughs> yes, feed them. You can feed the kangaroos. Can see the kangaroos. <laughs> no. No. Well, maybe he trusts me. Maybe he trusts me. Maybe he trusts me. See, this guy just escaped from his fence. Huh. 
my gosh, I never see penguins in this kind of yeah, habitat. Yeah, environment. Penguins are really unique coloring. Really unique coloring. Yeah, I liked its tail too. Here are the dingoes. Really evil. I don't even feel safe putting my fingers here. Yeah. <laughs> what is up people i am on the port of sydney shout out to my good friend egus and here's sydney's opera house really beautiful you can come in for 17 bucks australian dollars i don't know how much that in u.s dollars but it looks really nice you can see a lot of tourists taking pictures for the beautiful background along with the bridge and you get people all around the world coming to see Sydney. Sydney attracts all around the people around the world that I best be going.